you out today let's go back to Gio Guoka. I'm gonna meet up with Loretta and we're gonna go and explore and see if there's some more cool places to eat. Hi, Hi. I'm with this lovely lady. Hi guys. <laughs> Do you know who she is? It's Loretta guys. Do you guys have like Can a... Do you have like a name? I don't, I haven't created one. I just say like my community, yeah, but I can't think of popcorns. No, pop no. <laughs> She's already making up no, things no. for me. But yeah, actually, um, if you guys can think of a name of our community, that would be a good idea. Thank you for that. Oh, she's just full of ideas. We follow um, Loretta, no, Kamishi Chan. Yeah. No. Yeah. But, um, we're gonna go find somewhere to eat. We don't know yet, so we're just chilling here under the cherry blossoms. Can you see? There's a sign there that's really cute. It says, like, please protect the trees and don't smoke here. Normally, like, you can smoke almost anywhere in Japan, and mm. I thought it was really cute. Chill with your food. Don't ever smoke, but chill with your food and your drinks. You guys, he is so hot. <laughs> oh, oh, is he looking? Okay. Yeah, like I'm a sucker for nice beers. Okay, he's looking. Okay, maybe not. Let's just move it over here. <laughs> Usually I don't eat mashed potatoes. I thought it was fries. I it's like lighter than I expected in a good way. For pastas, I normally like a bit of a crunch to it. So I kind of want something crunchy mm. in there. What do you give the my meal? A seven. So it was still a little bit too. I wanted the noodles a little bit more under. These are all my personal. Preferences. preferences. I wanted the noodles a bit more under, but I wanted everything a little bit less. Al dente? Al dente. Al dente. Oh, the flavor was great. Hey, okay, that's a positive. Um, for me, I think I'd give mine an eight. I don't, I'm not really a fan of uh, mashed potatoes, but <laughs> the meat was bomb, right? Yeah, it was really it was good. so good. All right, sorry, let's dig in. I like totally <laughs> just started, like, while well, she's not looking. <laughs> Guys, you know, on the hunt for a good cheesecake. Oh my God, this tastes like breakfast, like American pancake. Get in there. Oh, wow. <laughs> Rejected. I, I don't like cheesecake. cheesecake. Oh, you don't? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Right? Go. This is like maple praline something. Like, mm. it's like, there's like a lemon schmooze and get in there. Ooh. This is a strange, a bizarre combo. It's like berries and caramel. Remember, guys, I said I like it dense. So, what do you say? It has to stick to the floor? Yeah, yeah. No, so, that's fine. It has to go so That's what it is. So, <laughs> so to cheesecake. It's good. A thud cake. A thud cake. That's a new thing. All right, let's go because I've got it. Wait, I don't even know what I'm going to do. You're going to be late. Get out of here. Okay, bye. <laughs> I'm at Jen's apartment. Oh, there she is. Oh, wait, no. Ah, no, this is fine. Oh, okay. Welcome to my house. It's a little messy. Oh, oh please. And then you see, I will be putting gleaming effects here just so. <laughs> yeah, it's so messy. And then cut to mine. Look how much space she has. I'm so jealous of it. Mm, yeah. The best feature. You. No. <laughs> it's the dishwasher. Oh, I've yeah. never actually seen the dishwasher before. Yeah, girl, I don't. I don't usually hand wash my dishes. Yeah. That's oh. a luxury. So Ooh. like. I'm gonna miss this when we move. Aww, oh, but yeah, damn, you're living the high life over here. Help me eat it. <laughs> Gladly. Like, that's what it looks like. It doesn't look that good, but. But I love sesame. Do you wanna smell it? I will. Mmm. You can taste. get this at like Japanese restaurants back home. Like, so in Canada, there's something called a seaweed salad. Yeah. Literally, I swear they buy it from Costco. Because oh. it's the same. We're just gonna have a natta, so I'm gonna turn this off. Back home now, let's try the salad, guys. Can you see that? By the way, how cute is this? Daruma, I love these. This is actually, I brought this local, so it's got a special meaning to me. This is from my local store. Okay. This can't be healthy. I'm sorry, Jen. It can't be. It's too good. Even if it came from the sea, even if it came from the heavens, even if it came from a unicorn's ass, even if it was cultivated, blessed by holy monks, I don't know. Sakura milk tea. I have not given up on the Sakura phase just yet. Still going strong, guys. It does have a mild floral slash cherry taste to it so it definitely tastes like sakura i feel like in um in japan they're very much on point with their taste if you like tea guys try the lipton sakura milk tea it's really good let's go
for my main event, guys. I don't know what they're chanting because we're walking right behind it. I feel like we're on some kind of like penis pilgrimage or something. See, it doesn't even work if it was yellow. I'd be like, follow the yellow. <laughs> That's but it doesn't work. <laughs> don't listen to the stereotypes, guys. <laughs> Some Japanese man just whispered to me, big penis, and I was like, yeah, really big. And then he went, little penis to himself. I was like, no, 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 daijoubu. <laughs> people have got like a good sense of humor around here, yeah. I feel. I've never seen so many penises in people's mouths before. <laughs> like, this is entertaining beyond belief. Pretty though guys, I want a pretty vagina. I'm currently on the hunt for like the pretty clip. I don't mind getting that one, but like I want a nice vagina, you know. I was saying that it needs to reflect like mine. Hello, I don't want an ugly one. You want an ugly vagina, not me. Oh is she? Oh is she? Oh yeah, tongue action, okay. So you said that somebody said that this is like the best um, Matsuri or festival, right? They've ever been to. But you know what? It's fun. It's, it's fun. Like I'm catching so much jerk. Yeah. Like there's this this guy. I was trying to like film his face, just the bottom half of his face sucking on the penis. Just to let you know that it's like very easy going here. Like men are sucking Everyone on them, girls. To one another. Yeah, yeah. It's like, cool. Jokes. Exactly. Very laid back. And he, I was like, oh, I don't want to put your face on YouTube, but can I like get you sucking on it? And he's like, don't worry, you can put my face in. And I was like, god damn. Hey, but you're not a dickhead though. You're very nice. Thank you. <laughs> Open, oh, I'm always keeping my eyes open. I'm always looking, girl. We're on the hunt for some savory. I can't. I have to say, it's savory penis, man. We're on the hunt for savory penis because everything here is like sweet. So yeah, if they did like a hot dog version. Yeah, yeah. you know, like, spice it up a bit. <laughs> it's quite soft. What do you rate it? Um, I would rate it maybe a seven. Could be better. It tastes like um, crab sticks you get back in England. The best part, guys. Look at that. The queue for this was absolutely huge. Mmm. That was it. Juicy. Really nice. So I'll give the cap sticks maybe like a five. I'll probably give them like a four, a bit rubbery. Right, so this is the Kanamara um, Festival. And what it's about, basically, the gist of it is uh, fertility and protection from STDs. And um, the origin of it is that um, a long time ago, this shrine was popular um, with sex workers um, at the tea houses. And to prevent them from getting STDs and stuff, they would pray for protection. Right, I'm gonna have to edit this like a bitch, hold on. Another story tells of a de demon who fell in love with a woman and hid inside her vagina. Edit, wait, wait a minute. Biting off the newlywed husband's penis twice, twice, not even once, twice, you know, they have to mention that, but anyway. Um, she then sought up help from the blacksmith who made her a metal phallus. Okay, so a metal penis. It broke the demon's teeth and sent him off for good. They later enshrined it in Kanayama Shrine as a sort of commemoration. The pink penis that you've seen in the that they're carrying, all the proceeds go to the HIV. So the portable shrines are carried by drag queens from um, a club named Elizabeth. So they're all part of the drag queen club. And I think that's very nice to support um, that here, support that community here. And it's quite refreshing to see. And I feel like the vibe here is very laid back. People are really friendly, we've already said, you know. Oh, there's some more drag queens right behind me. But um, yeah, I feel like people are more open um, during this festival, which is nice. It's nice to have inclusion. And I think that's very important. I've been raised off inclusion, so 
I love seeing it. And also here in Kawasaki, guys, if you didn't know, there is actually a gay pride parade as well, which I might be attending this year. We'll see. Yeah, so that's the story and just, I hope I explained it okay. I mean, I was reading most of it, but um, I just wanted you guys to know that there's an actual real reason for this happening. And it's not just, oh, look at the penises. Like there's a real deep meaning behind it and a message that they're trying to send us. So everybody out there, stay safe. Stay safe and protect yourself when it comes to sexual health, guys. And yeah. Anyways, let's get back to exploring. It is a lot bigger. <laughs> Much bigger than Asakusa. What Actually, is it? Is it? What's, what's bigger? <laughs> a lovely day for a stroll with a penis. <laughs> I'm gonna have to start stop sucking after a while because the jaw gets kind of tired. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do. Hey guys, if you wanna mess with me, I don't know what I mean. I decided to bite it off because there was some pervs in the background like watching us suck and lick on it. I was like, no, it's time, time for you to go. It is gonna be you. All right, guys, this lady is going again, but it was so fun hanging out with you. Such Thank a great you. time today. Yeah. That's a joke. Yeah. Tasty treats. Tasty treats. <laughs> All kinds of things. Yeah, I'm yeah. really happy. So. Say goodbye to her, see you soon. And say hello to this one. Hello. <laughs> we found each other, he just walked up next to me and I was like, who's this? Ah! So I'm gonna hang out with them for a little while and then go home, but yeah, anyways. Since we're here, since you didn't make it, you might as well have this then. Yeah. <laughs> You've got your very own. Yeah, my, my third one. <laughs> Okay, of the day. Oh, we are get. Get. Oh, <laughs> I'm back. After today, I feel so sexual. No, I don't actually. I feel quite responsible about my sexual health. I think we can all take from this just how important fertility is and safe sex is too. Be aware that STDs are real and people have problems every day and we can learn from those and protect the people that you know don't know let's educate and inform the energy has been amazing i took quite a lot of pictures with randoms so that's been fun i don't know if it's the hair <laughs> maybe it's the hair and people are like oh my god your hair's so cool and i'm like yay but you will never see this wig without a hat because the roots are terrible you want to see like dude what the, what what is that but anyways guys thank you for remaining active and wow i struggled to get that one out active and if you aren't active come and say hello let me know who you are say something man speak out say hi if you haven't done so already and you enjoy my content and the kind of style that i have then please give this video a like and subscribe because my community is growing and i want you to be a part of it too i also have instagram and i like to get up to some foolishness on there so check me out on there as well anyway until next time guys i love you so much Fight up, gamma tech, peace and love. Mwah. Bye.